Okay, should have all four corners tacked, but I can't get to that one from here, so three will work for me. What you need to do, why I did all that, is because when you start to weld along a seam like this, as that weld shrinks, it will actually pull the metal away and open up the gap. So you need to tack it on the bottom back side as well. So that everything stays rotate. in one place, right? Cool. There you go. And so that's argon CO2 that you're using? Yep. Argon CO2. And the reason why I'm doing that little weave pattern there uh -huh. is you always want to build your, your weld up from the base metal down here. Right. So if you just keep going along and making a big puddle of that, your, your arc is actually happening a good quarter quarter inch away from the base metal so it's not penetrating into the base. Right. Right. So and you want to go down into the base, then up onto your bead. Down into the base, up onto the bead. Down into the base, up onto the bead. Depending if, like, because if we're doing a horizontal here, it's fairly easy. Right. If you're doing verticals or, or sideways along it, you, you've got to use a little bit of a different pattern in order to keep your bead in an even shape. Because you don't want to, like, if you're welding along horizontally, if you, you don't want the bead to, to slag down, to slough down out of the weld, right? Right. you got to keep it in there. It's got to catch itself. And you use a different, bit of a different pattern to do that. There you go. If you look right there, you can see where the weld has burned into the base metal. Right. Right, and that's what you're looking for. Right. Could use a little bit more heat here because it's, you, I'm only getting about an eighth of an inch or so. But good enough for what we're doing here. So if you don't do that, the weld tends to break off? Is that the idea? Well, it doesn't adhere. Like you can see here where I started that other weld, it's a bit cold. Right. Right, see how it's beaded up and falling away? Yeah. Right.